guys, it's Kenzie. Welcome back to my channel. It's literally 11, 12, and this is my first time getting out of bed today. Yesterday, I had two shows. I had a show at one and a show at five, and I did, and I did La Fima Garde, Pas de Deux, and... And I, okay, I'm literally dying, like, I was so tired yesterday, like, my feet were hurting so bad. And I was really confused, because, like, you think... Okay, because last year I did Le Corsair Pas de Deux, and it didn't hurt as bad as this one hurt. And I was, like, really confused, like, why does this hurt so bad? Like, why am I struggling? Like, I literally could, couldn't breathe throughout the whole thing. And then I realized that usually in the Pas de Deux, like, the guy has... A, your, the variation before you and the guy I was doing with wasn't doing a variation but so after the paw like right after I had to do my variation and then right after that I had to do the coda so I had like zero break at all so then I felt kind of better about myself and I was like okay I get that like Lake or Sarah I had a lot of variations before I had to dance so yeah <laughs> so yeah it's just like a little studio performance I mean yeah but last year I did a vlog of this show i'll link it in a card but yeah so so saturday and sunday i had shows and today's monday and i didn't want to record saturday or sunday just because i just didn't really didn't feel like it i don't know because it was like my first shows of the year but today's monday and we're doing a little like ygp showcase thing and um um basically so everything that's going to ygp this year like we're doing a little showcase so we can like practice getting um used to like performing it and stuff and um yeah so i thought i would vlog that one just because it's a little less stressful i have like two variations and then um a contemporary solo um <laughs> so yeah i'm doing gamzati and uh grandpa classic i have to be there at 5 30 so i'll probably leave at like 4 30 but yeah i'll just show you guys what i what i'm gonna do before i I dance. So it's 12 and I'm literally just not eating breakfast. I like ran down here because I started feeling... <laughs> I started feeling so bad i was like i'm starving so i'm having a banana and i'm having some cereal because i am not about to make anything that takes more than like 20 seconds to make so yeah okay so it's like 4 20 and i really really have to go but i did my makeup and i did my hair as well and yeah now i have to go and we have warm-up class at 5 30 yeah I'm really, 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 really tired, so hopefully this show doesn't go bad really, really, really good. If it does, oh well. Hey guys, I'm back home. It's like 10.30. Um, I know I didn't show you guys a lot of like getting ready and stuff like that, but um, yeah, we didn't really have that much time between the show and like warm-up class, and I couldn't really film, like I just couldn't. So yeah, but I do have some clips clips from the show so i'll show you guys that so yeah okay so let's talk about the performance yesterday so i know i did not vlog a lot which i'm just a really bad vlogger all right like point blank period it's just hard to carry your camera around everywhere and film okay especially when you're in a dance setting and you're not allowed to film like you know what I'm saying? Like, you're not allowed to film class, like, things like that. Let's talk about my performances. Here's the tea. I was so tired. Like, you guys don't even understand. So, this show was, like, free, right? Um, Like, for the audience to come, it was free. But my my dad, my stepmom, my aunts, and my cousins, and my grandma and grandpa were coming. So, I was like, okay, Mackenzie, like, you actually need to put a lot of effort into this. So I did, I tried my best, um, but let's just say my technique, you know, it, it, it was better. My Gamzati variation, I don't have a video of that, unfortunately. I did it better because I performed it on Sunday and I did it better on the Sunday. Let's go on to Miss Grandpa Classic, girl, okay. <laughs>
The beginning of this variation, I felt like I was on fire, like I was like killing this, okay? Not gonna lie, it actually looks good for me. Like I was like, wow, like that's me? Okay, go off, you know? But then we go to the diagonal and I, before I did this variation, I was like, there's a very, very, very high chance that my ankle will give out during this because I haven't done this in a week and my ankle usually does give out sometimes in this variation, only on the last part of the diagonal. And what happens? <laughs> I don't even know if my ankle gives out. Obviously I was tired, right? So I guess my core, what I see from the video is like my core wasn't engaged. So I was like leaning back a little bit and then my ankle like rolls forward and then I couldn't get back up to the next releve or whatever. So <laughs> I was literally laughing at this part for like two minutes. It was so funny. Um, yeah, um, it's kind of embarrassing. Like if that happens at YGP, not the end of the world, but it's like, oof, you know? Um, it doesn't like break the whole dance. I don't think like in my opinion how that happened, <laughs> but I recovered and I wasn't like that mad at myself because you know what? I'm a human and this is a very hard variation. And then my contemporary solo. Okay, every time I perform my contemporary solo for the first time, I always rush the music. And in the beginning part, I was literally like lost in the music. I had no idea where I was because I was rushing, but I fixed it where I knew I could. So that was good. I think it's just because I get nervous. I don't know. But yeah, um, so that was my little vlog of my little performance and I hope you guys liked it Thank you guys so much for watching and leave your love by subscribing commenting and liking and yeah I'll comment back to you guys see you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much. Stay confident. Bye